watching uh, Salt, the channel all about sports and uh, interesting uh, subjects. We are in France uh, doing uh, some cyclo uh, tourism and uh, today I'm in uh, Montpellier. This is the city centre of Montpellier. It's uh, full of uh, young people. I was here last night and uh, the nightlife is really really great with many many bars and uh, many people uh, enjoying it. Anyway, this morning I'm going to take you through um, part of the city and we're going to go and see the Arc of Triumph and uh, the Chateau d'Eau, the water castle. Crossed over to La Verun. For a little roll in a cage. Final destination is Brésil. Voilà la place de l'église de Fabrega. Producer of uh, the south of France. Their main specialty is called uh, Picopoul of Pinay, of course, and uh, it is uh, paired with uh, oysters. The region we are in is uh, Languedoc, which is uh, usually dominated by uh, red wines, but uh, Le Picopoul de Pinay is uh, an exception. This is its uh, area of production. This area includes uh, five uh, villages, among which uh, Pinay. Pomerol and uh, uh, Castel uh, de Guerre. And uh, the whole area used to belong to a religious group uh, uh, located in Age before the French Revolution. But they lost their land, they moved to Montpellier. Uh, however, uh, the chateau continued uh, producing this uh, white wine, and uh, the clergy preferred the white wine to red wine because uh, during Mass, they didn't have to keep on uh, keep keep on uh, washing uh, all the cups they drank from. Madame is the tenth generation of uh, ladies uh, of this wine, and so it's a woman uh, tradition that uh, is being passed on because uh, she has uh, passed it on to her daughter. That will be generation number eleven. Some uh, of the many heritage sites uh, I found along the way. This is um, an ancient uh, water mill that used to belong to the Benedictine uh, convent uh, nearby. And uh, just across uh, the river, the Roman uh, bridge that was built uh, to favor Via Domitia crossing France. Over this 